dumpling I gotta tell you. What? I'm hungry. So what if you're hungry? Wait for you. Then let's give some likes. I'm so glad I saved y'all from all the cringe. So, anyways, before we proceed with the video, as usual, don't forget to smash on the like button, but I don't support violence. But please, if you don't support violence too, please subscribe. Like, please, people, please. <laughs> Come back to the channel, and I hope everyone's doing okay. And today we will be making some dumplings. And this are the ingredients for the things that we will need. So, among the things which we will be needing is some minced chicken, there's some chopped mushrooms, there is also some gelatin type of thingy I'll talk about later, there's that minced spring onion, some pepper, some mushroom water from the chopped mushrooms, and then an empty plate, an empty bowl, and all these pastries for that. And I forgot what it's called, and some water to stick it. Yeah, it's not an empty plate. <laughs> so, uh, what we're going to do is first we're going to put in the chicken, and then we're also going to add in other ingredients, like, um, I forgot what the ingredients are. I'm so forgetful, I'm sorry. Just give me a moment. First we add in the chicken, and then we add in the mushroom, and then we add in more mushroom, and then we add in some spring onions, and then we add in more spring onions, and then we add in some pepper? Yeah, the pepper. And after we add in the pepper, <laughs> we... Okay, let's see. And we're taking that gelatin thing. Actually, this is actually chicken stock, and also um, aga aga powder, that's how you get it because we're doing soupy dumplings, so in order to get away with it. So, what you're gonna do is you're gonna, after you mix it up, it's gonna look like that, and then what you're gonna do is you're going to add in all of this inside. Then you shouldn't add in too much, then it'll be very difficult for you to wrap it up. Also, if you would like to see a video of me wrapping this up on um, tutorial on how to do it, please comment that below. So, after you add in all these fillings, which kind of look bad, but trust the process, people. You're gonna fold it like like that, like one by one piece, not piece by piece, side by side, and it becomes like that, or you can try the other version. And then after you're gonna put them in the steamer. I think I put it in for about 20 minutes because who doesn't like a nice sauna, you know? Saunas are good, right? That's just me showing off my chopstick skills. <laughs> and yeah, there we go, 20 minutes. See, I'm not that forgetful at all. <laughs> yeah, they look delicious. I'm kind of hungry actually, watching videos of what I did, but it's okay. I actually ate this already. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah. Now we have this Momo's dumplings or Jolong Bao's. I hope I pronounced it right. And now let's see. The soup. In it. The soup. The soup. Soup. Why is it not cutting? Why is it not cutting? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's the soup? No. <laughs> it's okay. Even though this was a fail, we can do it again. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and that's all I have for you guys today. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and as well as subscribe. And see you in the next video.